when Chinese New Year meets Nepali culture of Nepal. 2024 Chinese Lunar New Year meets with historical cultural Nepali communities, Hadigao, Vaktupurdarwar Square, and Patandarwar Square on its fifth day of celebration. The dragon, lion, and kiring, Chinese mythical creatures which are regarded auspicious, were paraded through all the three states door of Kathmandu Valley. Chinese and Nepali, Newari in specific, cultural amalgamation events in all three districts of Kathmandu Valley were organized in three different hours throughout the whole day by Chinese Embassy in cooperation with Nepal Tourism Board and Chinese Overseas Association from very early morning. The dragon dance, lion dance, and kiring dance were performed in all three districts. This dance is taken auspicious and almost compulsorily played for every auspicious occasion in China. The first event was held in Harigao, Kathmandu. Harigao welcomed Ambassador of China to Nepal, His Excellency Chongsheng, and Deputy Mayor of Kathmandu Metropolitan City, Sunda Dangol, in an auspicious way by putting tikka, black bhad gauli topi, and traditional red necklace called dhoza on neck at the entrance of the community. This is the respectful gesture to welcome guests in Nepali community on any auspicious occasion. The Nepali flute was played as a welcome music. Deputy Mayor Ms. Sunita Dangol, wishing the Basanta Panchami and the Spring Festival to all the attendees, also expressed, not just between two governments, but we expect the relationship would get elevated between two people of the nation as well. His Excellency Chongsheng, the Chinese ambassador to Nepal, participated in three parades and gave a speech. He imparted his belief that this New Year's parade would give the general public and tourists a unique experience of Chinese Spring Festival. Likewise, the Lion Dance of Chinese and Lucky Dance of Nevars were performed consequently, which both were the vault of energetic presentation, soured a great applaud from the audience. Lucky is another form of demon. One of the myths informs that the demon had fallen for a human girl and danced to please the society after his identity was revealed. The second event at Bhaktapurdarwar Square, starting from 1 p.m., continued for two hours straight. Mr. Sunil Prasapati, mayor of Bhaktapur municipality, was greatly honored as a chief guest of the event celebrated in Bhaktapurdarwar Square. Makha Pekha, played by Bhaktapur young boys at the white ground of Bhaktapurdarwar Square, represented culture and religion, at the same time resembling Hanuman in a dancing form. The dance is also popular in Bandipur, performed by a migrated group of Bhaktapur. Unique Devi dance, which included numerous characters, was performed. Eighteen persons representing the town's guardian pantheon took part in the dance performance. Lucky dance was also performed. Similarly, because Manstrasta, chairman of Ward No. 5, attended as a chief guest of the event organized in Patandarva Square. Patan performed their guest with Nevari cultural dances on Likawaya and Sitasaya Heku, which was elegantly presented, seemed to be enjoyed and appreciated by the crowd highly. The flute was played on a Nevari song by a group of Nevars and traditional Nevari attire. Lucky dance was also a highlight. At this unusual and unique combination of the celebration of Chinese New Year and Nepali Basanta Panchami, the event was crowded with hundreds of visitors, passerbys, locals and tourists, while the cultural accents between youths could also highly be noticed in spite of lingual differences. The whole community dived to the ceremony. The ceremony was attended by hundreds of youths, Nevari women and men in Nevari attire in all three districts of the valley, which reflects deep and rich cultural value of Nevari community. Chinese culture in assemblance with Nevari culture released and aroused powerful positive wave around the whole Kathmandu Valley.